And welcome back. New tonight in TechSmart, developers keep finding new ways to use AI. Now it's being used to help with yard work. Rich Demiro takes a look at a new lawnmower cutting the grass on its own. With a name like Electric Sheep, you know they're doing something interesting. Recently, I checked out AI-powered robotic lawnmowers from a startup that wants to make maintaining the outdoors easier. Mowing large lawns usually looks like this. But in the future, it might look more like this. The cool part is like we didn't need to teach this anything. There's just an on-off button, and it's semantically aware of its surroundings. Jarrett Harold is co-founder of Electric Sheep, a company building autonomous robots to take care of outdoor landscaping. Rather than a, a guy sitting on top of a machine just going back and forth in straight lines, we've uh, handed off those workflows to our robots. The quiet, all-electric mowers are programmed with AI that gets smarter with every job. They're robots that have common sense. That's where AI comes in. So. They really just have to be set down um, and pointed in the right direction and you hit start. The bots are deployed alongside landscaping crews who can focus on other tasks. It's hard to hire people to do this work, essentially. Right now, they're operating at campuses, parks, and more. It's been interesting. Ed Nolan has been using them for a few months at the condo complex where he's HOA president. He got interested in the robot's electric appeal, less noise and better for the environment. When I came to California 10 years ago, I would never believe that I would be driving an electric car. Um, but I think it's good, I think it's good, I think it's more efficient. Of course, safety is a top concern. The key aspect is it has a stereo camera in the front um, and it's able to uh, identify things that it needs to uh, stay away from. These robots have been trained using AI with thousands of pictures of things like people and pets. So if you happen to get in front of one of them, it's should stop and or turn around. Thank you. But will these automated bots cut out humans in another way? It's not meant to be a labor displacement. It's, it's meant to work alongside humans to compound their productivity. So how good of a job do these electric sheep do? Well, in my demo, it was tough to tell because the lawn was already pretty well maintained. But unlike a Roomba, which can go in various directions, these robots are taught to make those great looking lawn stripes. I'm Rich Demiro, and you are Tech Smart.